So now I'm all ready for the gym. I got my pre-workout, my pre-build by Muscle Tech, and then I got my gallon jug of water that I'll be drinking on. So I will see you after my workout. What's going on everyone? So this is like the fifth time I did this commentary because when I was out of town uh, last week with bodybuilding.com, I did not bring my microphone. So I was trying to do it on my computer and I was in the hotel and so it sounded so bad. It was so echoey so I could not use the audio from that. So when I got home, I decided I'm just going to redo this whole entire thing. So this is like the fifth time uh, trying this. So First off, I hope you're enjoying the video. So this workout I worked out with Justin and it is an intense chest workout. So we started off with incline barbell bench press. We did tons of sets. We did right at seven working sets of incline uh, bench press. So tons of sets. So the rep range was uh, 10 reps. We got eight reps and then another set of eight. And then I wanted to lift as heavy as possible. So I did four uh, sets of around four to five reps. And on the last set, the seventh set did a triple drop set. And that's what you're watching right now. So this is the heavy set for four reps and then immediately rack the weight. And then I pulled off the two tens on each side. So went down to 225 uh, and then repped it out for another five to six reps just until failure and then racked it again and then pulled off, I believe, the 45 and put the 25 on there, so it was right at 185 pounds, and then went to failure again for around, I guess, you know, six to eight reps, whatever failure was, uh, trying to rest as little as possible. So when I get up, I try to strip off the weight uh, very quickly. Uh, the faster you do that, uh, the more benefits you're going to get out of doing a drop set. If you just slowly go into it and then do the drop sets and stuff, you're not going to get the full benefit of doing the drop set. And this is the last drop set I did. I think I had a 10 on each side, so not that much weight, but went for around, I think the last uh, triple drop set I did, I think it was around 10 to 12 reps on there. After that, went into more bench press. We went on to the Smith machine. Now, this is at a 30 degree incline on this bench. So what a 30 degree incline is, all you do is raise the bench by one notch. So it's not at a 45, it's just lower than that. So just raise the bench by one notch and that's 30 degrees. And so we did five sets of these for around 10 to 12 reps. And on the last set, we did the exact same thing we did on the incline bench. We did a triple drop set and just going to failure on every single one of those uh, drops. And the Smith machine is great because you don't have to worry about getting stuck underneath the bar because when I was doing the incline uh, bench press, if you go back and watch, I actually got stuck under the bar and uh, Justin had to put down the camera and go over there and pick up the weight because I tried to go for a fifth rep and I just could not do it. I got more than halfway up but then got stuck. So if Justin wasn't there, I'd be in trouble. So after that, we went into flat dumbbell bench press. Now this, we didn't go too heavy. This was all about volume. So we stuck around 12 to 15 reps. We did five sets. And this was kind of like time under tension as well because as you can see, I'm trying to do perfect form and slow reps. So I'm not just going crazy and going really quick. I'm trying to squeeze the whole entire time going down slow and going up slow. So trying to contract that chest through the whole range of motion. And we weren't resting that long in between these sets. So I would go and immediately uh, Justin would go. And then on the last set, the fifth set, we did a triple drop set. Now for the first two movements of this workout, I was resting around two minutes because we were lifting so heavy. So after this, we went into a superset and I did not film the whole entire superset because Justin actually had to leave so he couldn't record, but it was a lot of sets. I ended up doing eight sets of these. Uh, yeah, I know, crazy amounts of volume. I was actually waiting on Justin because he was talking to someone, so I thought he was gonna come back. And so I ended up doing set after set after set. So high to low cable flies, 12 to 15 reps, superset with bench push-ups that I did not record for around 15 and 20 reps just until failure, and those were eight sets. But that's the end of the workout. If you wanna give this workout a shot, it'll be written down in the description box. Thank you so much for watching.
Well, now it's nine o'clock. I'm about to go to bed because I've been waking up so early and I got so much to do tomorrow. I gotta wake up, do another video, and then work out. I think I'm only gonna work out once tomorrow and not do cardio. So I think I'm gonna do like morning circuits and then be done with it to give my body a little rest because I think that if I go do cardio and workout and stuff, I'll be holding a little bit more water. But guys, I'm gonna end the video here tonight so I can pick up the camera and start off another video tomorrow, uh, which is a day out from my show, and then I'm gonna film, of course, the day of my show. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please give the video a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. All right, guys, peace. It seems to be like it's gonna be a real, it seems to be like it's gonna be a real relaxed. Uh, it seems like it's gonna be a real uh, laid back.